my fellow students, it is most meet that we should again gather for the purpose of choosing our own government. By our own design, the grandeur of the public matter overcomes any individual's weakness and creates in him the sort of candidate most respectful of the will of his people. By that will has the government of the students garnered admiration and sought to create a lasting compact with its founders. No compromise has been wrought, nor any forced. I mean to say that just as your government has resolved matters in your favor, no ideal dear to us has been surrendered. We cherish our policies as they are. Testing should exist for the well-being of the students, and no rule should exist that restricts a student's ability to at any time, for any reason, choose his own way. There have been attempts from time to time for radical, unyielding change. This government believes that the sovereign students neither require nor deserve this. There have been attempts to nullify the equality and universality of our student government. In my ironical position as the truly experienced candidate, I declare that this great democracy must stand open to all. Remember why you convene here, and bear in mind the truth of the idea that these halls exist for us. Lastly, I come to the individual whose endowment shall be the greatest in the people's gift. Do as you nobly would, my fate is yours.